Hi folks, good to be with you. Love to everybody out there. God bless you and I uh, hope everybody's okay. Happy New Year to everybody. I'm glad you, I'm glad to see you and uh, to be honest I'm glad that it's all over. Uh, it gets uh, a bit tiring I think uh, just staying in the house so I'm glad to in the next few weeks I'll be getting out more uh, doing a bit of street preaching here and there so it's good to be with you. Love to everybody and hope everybody's okay. Don't forget You've got my um, website, jasonburnspreacher.com. It's a good website. There's a lots of material there for you. And you'll be really blessed. So please uh, get hold of my website. Spread it around. Let people know about it. And it'll be a blessing to them. Um, there's nothing heretical on it. It's all solid stuff. And it will edify you. Lots of free books. Lots of material there. And it, and it will help you and encourage you. Um... So you've got jasonbirdspreacher.com, you've got my Facebook, which uh, I post on my Facebook from time to time, uh, good preachers and other things uh, that will help you. And then on my Twitter, from time to time, I post apologetic material uh, of sites or articles that will help you. So please uh, don't forget my Twitter, don't forget my Facebook, and don't forget my website, jasonbirdspreacher.com. Uh, it's not about promoting myself, I just have that site up to help people I really do it cost me it cost me 280 pounds um, this year uh, last year it I paid like once every two years so it cost me 280 pounds and I, I keep that site up for the pure reason to help people that that's the only reason why I have that site there it's there to help people to encourage people to to build people up in the faith so when I'm street preaching evangelizing I, I let people know about it and they go on and it and it encourages them it helps them and people can learn about the gospel and Christianity and so the sites there for you and your friends and your family so pass it on say have you been on J Jason Burns uh, it's a really good site really good material and it'll help you so it's not about promoting me, it's about promoting the truth and on that site there's lots of things on there that will help you and be a blessing. Um, what else? Uh, yeah, so you've got Facebook and Twitter and also I've written a number of books. I've written um, The Reformed Pastor, um, Under the Radar, The Life and Thought of Sam Harris and uh, there's like little booklets like uh, 10 reasons why the Quran is not the word of God books that I've edited like the corruption of the Quran the Trinity in Islam uh, the reform faith in Islam those are books that I've edited uh, so there's lots of books out there on Amazon that either I've edited or I've written uh, a, a really nice devotional book is um, uh, the age of austerity and another one is at the feet of Jesus. These are really nice devotional works that will help you. Uh, so please pass on these books. Let people know about them. You can read them for free if you want. Or you can buy them. If you buy them you'll be helping me in my ministry. And encouraging me in, in my ministry. I want to say a big big thank you to people. There's been some people that have been sending me some lovely emails. And I want to thank you for these emails and also some lovely comments on YouTube. One gentleman said uh, you're really gifted and you're welcome to come on holiday in Wales. And I, I really appreciate these kind of comments. So thank you so much for the emails and the comments on YouTube. I really appreciate it. I also want to thank the people who said that they want to meet up with me. Some guys in Wales uh, want to meet up and others for street preaching. I'll let you know when I'm around. Um, so I really appreciate that and also for those who got in contact at Christmas particularly John who invited me to his church on, uh, for Christmas meal really enjoyed that and it was a real blessing so thank you so much <coughs> I want to thank you for everybody who supported me there are people that have given donations to me uh, people that have given me money for a number of things over the last year so I want to thank everybody for all the support all the encouragement and people who've worked alongside me, like Frank, uh, um, Gareth, Mike, Kieran, and a number of others, 
uh, who, who stood alongside me. I really appreciate it. So thank you uh, so much. I really, really appreciate it. So this, this video is basically telling you uh, about Africa. Folks, I'm, I'm definitely going to Africa. Uh, I'm the president of Grace uh, Bible College and Theological Seminary and for, for Africa. So my responsibility will be to train pastors, uh, to be preachers of the word and young people to do missionary work. I'll be going in April this year. So as soon as I get there, I hit the ground running. I'll be lecturing. I'll be teaching. I'll be, I'll be absolutely doing the. I'll be just teaching and and, and lecturing. So, so I'm going to be there in April. I'm going to be doing that, and I believe in what I'm doing. I believe that that's at the moment what God wants me to do. Because there's such a need for expository preachers in, in, in Africa and preachers of the word and for gospel work because there's a lot of this health and wealth stuff and, and, and it's all about being a super pastor and, and selling your oil and all this and we're not about that, we want to teach the word, you want to teach the word, we want to get the word out and, and spread the word and and build people up and we're not in it for the money etc so I want to instill this in the future generation of pastors in Africa um, I've not given up on the UK I will come back one day to finish the job I believe that God will use me to to preach on the streets in the future excuse me for my itchy nose and um, I believe that God will use me in that in the future but for the next few years, I just need to go to Africa to help get Ghana and hopefully wider field a vision for solid expository preaching and gospel ministry. And uh, so that's where I'm going to be going, what I'm going to be doing now. Um, things are happening. I'm going down to London. Um, next week for a couple of days I'll be doing a bit of street preaching and evangelism but I'm also going to meet a director of a charity that are going to donate uh, a, a large number of books a couple of crates even more crates maybe four crates with 32 boxes of books on each crate now I need your encouragement I need your help and support I need you to support that ministry there to get these books from the UK over to Ghana I need to give a donation for each of the boxes then I need to get the books over to Manchester into a container then send that container over to Ghana it's going to need financial help it's going to need people who believe in what I'm doing to get behind that project and I've only got a few days to get it going so I need your help to say to your church look will you sponsor will we sponsor uh, a, a couple of boxes of books to this guy and give a donation uh, to this ministry that he is he, involved with so we can get these books or can we help raise funds to get this container over to Africa I need your help to do that I need you to spread the word to get people involved in any shape or form with this project. These books are not going to be like super academic books which are going to spoil people's minds. These books are classics. They're going to be classics like Albert Barnes, and Spurgeon and things like that that will really help people to be on fire for God. So please, please pray about getting involved and, and supporting this project. I would love if I could, I would really really love if I could it was stretching my faith, but to send another container full of clothes and materials for those who are poor in Ghana. There's a, there's a church in Winneby that has a school, and there are schools that I don't have a lot of material, and there's a lot of poverty there, and I would love to send another container, but that would need, I need people to get behind that and say, you know, let's go for a second container as well, we'll do it. 
and uh, we'll send them the clothes we'll send the material so if if anybody out there would has the finances that could help with that that would be great it's not for me it's not for you it's for the glory of god and to help people who really need help and i just want to help i just want to help these people i really do I, I can't forget these people i have to go and help them i really really do and then it won't spread there but it, it will it, it won't be just there but in the future i hope i can help other african countries as well and places but the project at the moment is i need to get these books across to ghana and i'm meeting the director uh, mid next week to to look at the books and to finalize uh, certain things concerning that project so i'm not very practical i'm a preacher so please pray about this and please if you're practical get involved and then long term i need you to stand with me in for the ghana project i really really do because it's going to be a, at least four or five years and when william carey went to india um they his supporters dropped off little by little over the years and i need people to say you know what i'm going to stand with this ministry it's a five-year project at least it's going to be tough for this guy and we're going to stand with him we're going to pray we're going to sow into his ministry we're going to help this ministry to set up this bible college and theological seminary that's going to train people to preach the gospel and to to be expounders of the word of god and what a privilege and what a wonderful blessing it could be if we could get hundreds if not thousands of ministers across africa that are going to expound the word of god like lloyd jones just expound the pure word of god rather than all this health and wealth and snake oil selling oil and, and making money and all the rest of it so you could be sowing into that and that that could you you, you would be involved in spreading the word of God in a proper way throughout Africa. So I need to get there, I need to stay there, and then I need to help get this summary going. So I'm asking you to stand with me. If you want to stand with me, under this video is GoFundMe. So if you want to, I've, I've put a, a sum that, that I would need over the next year and some of it's to do with travel in terms of like we, we i would need some kind of transport there um and then living allowances over the next year a year and a half etc so that's what you'll be sewing into uh, and then some of that money will be used for the container uh, etc so so please pray about it stand with me uh, so the GoFundMe is underneath there if you want to stand with me in that way. If you want to be part of the mission team, uh, part of my mission team where I, I let you know every week what's happening. Uh, if you go to jasonburnspreacher.com, email me there and I'll send you a newsletter. I'll send you uh, a, a letter every week. And... Uh, sorry, every couple of weeks, every two weeks or something and then uh, maybe a, a news a proper large newsletter once a month so that you know what's happening etc okay so i love you all and i'm just asking whatever you do at least pray for this project at least put this ministry in your prayer diary every day be praying for it every day be praying uh, for this project I will be in London on the 16th and 17th and I'll also be there all day the 18th and be leaving late at night so if anybody wants to meet up street pre I'm definitely going I've, I've booked uh, a very cheap uh, guest place so I'll be definitely going um, 16th, 17th and 18th so if anybody wants to meet up in London to minister together uh, get on in touch with me on Facebook say Jay I'd like to meet up with you 
uh, what time will you be in London, etc. And we'll do some street preaching. Particularly, I'm going to go, uh, God willing, to the House of Parliament and do a little bit of preaching on the 16th and 17th. I think on the 18th they're having a bit of a break at uh, Parliament. So maybe on the 16th we'll do a bit of street preaching uh, at Parliament. And then spend the rest of the time on the 17th and 18th um, doing preaching and evangelism around London. So if you're interested in that, let me know and uh, you can join me. Okay. All right, God bless you. Love you all. I'm going to say a little prayer for all you out there who've supported me. I'm going to pray for your families, that God will bless you and give you back what you have given me in terms of support and encouragement. So let's pray. Father, we thank you for this day. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, these three are one. And Father, I thank you for your love and your grace and your encouragement, Lord. You are a great and mighty God, and I give you the praise and the glory. And Father God, I pray, well, we praise you, O God. We worship you and we give you the glory, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. And Father, I pray, Father, I pray in the name of our Lord that you bless every person who listens to this video. I pray that you bless their families. I pray that you bless their friends. And I pray it will be a good year, Lord, for them. I pray it says, uh, no weapon formed against thee shall prosper. And I pray every attack upon every person that listens to this video will be cancelled out each day in their lives. And I pray, O oh God, they would increase in faith, in love, in holiness. And that, Father, you would just bless them mightily. Encourage them and strengthen them in their walk with you. And may they walk and serve you, Lord, all their days. Bless them, provide for them, and help them in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Give him the glory. I, I can only thank him for what he's doing. That he refreshes us and helps us and blesses us and encourages us. And I want to thank you again. For those who have given to my ministry, those who have stood with me and helped me, I really, really appreciate it. And so God bless to everybody out there. God bless you.